people who know me know that I, I, I draw a lot of parallels between dentistry and what I do. I'm going to do that again. You would tell your patients in dentistry that the cheapest and least invasive way to look after their mouths is to brush and floss because it's a whole lot easier to do that than to deal with what happens when you don't. Embezzlement's not a whole lot different, uh, but don't take my word for it. I'm going to let you hear from one of our clients and a friend of mine named Dr. David Hughes. David's an orthodontist in Virginia, and he got taken to the cleaners for an amount of about $370,000 from his office manager. So let's hear from David and what he went through. So you're looking at losing enough money to derail your entire timeline for how long you have to work. And it was greatly disruptive to my home life to an extent that it's life-changing. Like it's terrible. It's the money going away is only the beginning of it because you have to, how do you factor in months and months, if not years of lost sleep and like self-doubt and distraction and taking your mind offline when you really should be focused on your patients and your profession and your family. Incidentally, David will be our guest in a webinar on January 26th when you get to hear the full story of what's happened to him. And there's a registration link in the email that uh, came with this video. Our owner proactive strategies program is the most advanced protection program for dentists in existence. I'd love to talk to you about it. Why don't you give me a call?